Was inspired by a letter I received from a fan. Dear Erica, can you do a video on how to knit the perfect baby blanket? Love mom. Great, great question. Fan. To distinguish your blanket as American, make sure to use red, white, and blue yarn. That's the color of the American flag. Now it's time to find the knitting needles. Somewhere in here. It's like finding the hay in a, a, a needle stack. <laughs> oh, sweet baby Jefferson founding father! Once you have your needles in your yarn, make sure to practice proper knitting form. Like a puzzle, you want to start with the edges first. Most people think knitting is so passe, but I think it's a way to get in touch with your sensual side. Yikes! Beware of these common knitting injuries. Stabbing, pricking, yarn burn, strangulation, humiliation, and of course, Montezuma's revenge. <sighs> there are so many knitting misconceptions. Like the other day, a full grown man approached me and he said, but Erica, I want to attract women. Well, the best way to attract a woman is with some sexy knitted lingerie. Knitting can be done anywhere, at home, on a walk, driving, listening to your sermon, relaxing in a tub, climbing a tree, first dates, the library, waiting for the bus, having Mexican food, first trip to the zoo, adoption agencies. Don't get discouraged if your baby blanket takes more than 17 days to complete. Remember, don't sleep with your knitting needles. And when you're done, you'll have a blanket any American baby would be proud to sleep with. It's like a, a song and a blanket. Lullaby baby to sleep. You're an American and you're gonna be president one day. Or maybe you're just the house majority leader. You can't spell American.